In yesterday's video, I showed you how to find the hottest items to sell on eBay by using the Google search operators. But today, I'm going to show you how you can simplify the whole process and gather even more results at a much greater rate by using eBay Keyword Sniper Pro. Now, if you didn't see yesterday's video, be sure to check the link in the description of this video to watch it because that video is very informative and important to watch if you plan on finding the best items to sell on eBay. So be sure to look for that link in the description of this video. Okay, so using eBay Keyword Sniper Pro to find the hottest items to sell on eBay makes the process very quick and easy. This tool is worth a million dollars because using this tool, it's going to help you earn a lot of sales over time simply because it reveals the hottest items in a matter of only a couple minutes. And you'll be able to generate more sales than your eBay competitors simply because they will not have the same access to these types of insights without using this software. Oh my God, how's oh he doing dear. that? How did he do uh, that? I don't know. This software really gives you an unfair advantage since they won't know how you're generating so many sales and surpassing them. So let me jump right in and show you a quick demonstration of how to use eBay Keyword Sniper Pro to find hot products to sell by using the combination of Google, Yahoo, and eBay search engines all in one shot to quickly extract out all this very valuable data for yourself. Let's go ahead and uh, jump right into this right now. Okay, so I'm here with eBay Keyword Sniper Pro, and I'm going to show you this quick demonstration. Let's go ahead and open up the Hot Items Finder by clicking this little flame icon right here. Okay, we're going to go ahead and open this up a little bit more so you can see what's going to happen here. Um, all right, so we got this set up. I'm just going to go ahead and enter in any niche. Uh, the one that I'm going to use in this demonstration is fishing. So um, that way we can pull up a, a great variety of hot items for uh, like fishing poles, fishing tackle, fishing this and that and the other, all in the uh, fishing niche. So I'll go ahead and enter in fishing and then I'll select the Google search engine. I'll select Yahoo and I'll select eBay. It's going to ask me how many pages that I'd like to go into eBay. We'll just leave it set at the default value of three and click OK. And then now all I have to do is click this little search icon right here, this magnify glass. And what it's going to do is it's going to go over to Google. It's going to find all the hot items from Google. Um, it's going to go to Yahoo and find all the hot items. And it's going to go to eBay to find all the hot items. So let's go ahead and click the uh, search icon here. Now the program is going to go and collect the hottest fishing items from all three search engines. So I'm going to let the program run a couple of minutes here. Then I'll come back to explain what each column of data means to you. Uh, this won't take long at all to do. So I'll just go ahead and let it run through and I'll come right back and explain it. Okay. So I'm back and I just want to quickly explain which, uh, each one of these columns means um, okay so starting from the left here shows the actual seller for the product or the item it shows the product title right here the price that's listed at the shipping fee if it's a top rated plus listing it'll say either uh, yes or no um, let me scroll back up here okay uh, it'll let you know um, the feedback score in this column here it shows the seller's feedback score. Here's the uh, feedback percentage for the seller. Um, it, now, the, the main, the two main columns that you really need to focus on are uh, the sold column and the hot signals um, columns. The next one over is the amount of followers that the seller has right here. And it actually shows in the next column how long that they've been a member of uh eBay, how long they've been selling on eBay for. Um, the last column over here on the far right just shows the actual link to the uh, listing. Okay. But again, uh, we really want to focus on the number sold and the hot signal in order to find out whether it's a hot item or not. So what we could do is uh, look through what the program has found here and we can see, uh, for example, that this one has sold here uh, four times in the last 24 hours. Uh, this one here has sold seven times in the last 24 hours. Um, 59 are viewed per day. Uh, 162 are viewed per day for this item here. 
um, 11 watched in the last 24 hours, uh, 25 viewed per day, 196 viewed per day. Oh, wow. Look at this one right here. It shows 2,020 are viewed per day for this particular item. Let's see what that item is real quickly here. Um, 30 piece metal fishing lure sp uh, spinner bait. That's pretty cool. Uh, this We know that right there, this item must be very hot because we can see that there are 2,020 views per day for this particular item. That's a very hot signal right there. And pretty much you would just uh, go down and you look through here and you can see that some of them actually um, don't have any information. You'll see like an NA, which means uh, not available. So what we want to do is just filter down to only seeing the hottest items, the ones that have hot signals, okay, and have been sold many times. So the way that we can do that is we can use this filter option right here. If we click on this filter icon, we'll go ahead and click that. And we want to get rid of all the ones that have NA in it, like these ones here say have NA. So the way that we can do that is we just click right here where it says remove items with NA on the hot signal. Click that. And what it's going to do is filter all those out, get rid of those, and only leave you with the ones that um, have hot signals. So you can see that 354 items have been removed. So we'll click OK. And um, let's make sure that all the items have the keyword fish in there. Okay. We just want to make sure that it pertains to fishing. Okay. We'll click filter and we can see now that it's removed 20 more items from the list. Okay. We'll close that. And now when we take a look at the hot signal column here, we're left with only the hottest products with all hot signals. Look at that. Wow. It's like filtering out all the uh, dirt and leaving you with gold because, uh, now we know exactly which items are hot sellers on eBay. So now what we can do is uh, take this information and what we'll do is we'll uh, keep track of it by saving it on our hard drive. So we click generate report right here. And what it's going to do is going to quickly create a report for phishing. We just have to give it a second here. And um, we'll, we'll go ahead and uh, select where we want to save this report. We'll save it uh, in the same folder as the eBay Keyword Sniper Pro. And now it's going to open up the report in our default web browser automatically. And here it is, guys. Look, hot items report for phishing. That's, that was the original keyword that we were trying to target to uh, pull up a bunch of cool fishing items that are hot sellers. And as you can see, everything matches with uh, what we had here on the software before we uh, generated this report. Everything should be uh, perfectly lined up. Okay, so uh, let's take a look at this report and you can see uh, we're just left with a bunch of, here's the hot signals and, and the numbers sold. We're left with just a bunch of hot items here. And now we can always keep track of these items. So that way we know exactly um, what we can sell on eBay and uh, can end up being a hot seller for us. So at this point, we'd keep track of this report here, keep track of these items. We would go find the supplier and uh, link up with the suppliers for the same types of items. And now when we go to sell these items on eBay, we know what's exactly, you know, what's going to be hot in advance. So that way we don't waste our time investing in products that are not going to be successful. Okay, so uh, let me show you one other thing here before we leave. Uh, we can also click right here where it shows uh, view listing, and that will quickly open up the listing in another tab. And you can see that everything matches up. Um, let me enlarge this here to 100%. I accidentally had it down to 80, I think. Okay, back at 100%. So you can see there were 7,779 items that sold. There's six viewed per day. And if we look back here, we can see that same information, 7,779, six viewed per, oh, I'm sorry, six viewed per hour. Okay, so that is definitely a hot item, this item right here. Um, let's take a look at, let's see the next one down. It shows that there's seven sold in the last 24 hours right here on this item. And um, we'll go ahead and click that view listing on the far right. And sure enough, 
Let's see. Up, oh, yeah, seven sold in the last twenty-four hours, and uh, one thousand nine hundred ninety-nine have sold for this item. So this is definitely a really hot uh, fishing reel here that we can see. And uh, if we went to sell the same similar item, or maybe this even the same exact item, if we can find the same types of connections, we'll know in advance that this is going to be a, a hot seller for us. As long as we can match the price too, of course, you have to take other factors into consideration, but at least you have a great idea of what items are hot and what's selling on eBay. The software makes it very easy to uh, narrow things down to the hottest items, so that way you have this valuable data. You always know what types of items that you could sell, which would potentially become a hot seller for you. Okay, so uh, I want to go ahead and conclude this video. I'm glad that you guys um, have taken the time to watch it and uh, have seen what your options are. Um, this is much faster to do it this way by using the software eBay Keyword Sniper Pro. It has the hot items finder uh, module built into it to take away all the time consuming tedious work for you, make everything very easy for you to find your golden nugget keywords uh, and your products. Okay, so I'm glad that you took the time to watch this video. Hope you learned something out of it. And uh, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe to our newsletter if you haven't already. Um, and go ahead and, you know, check out eBay Keyword Sniper Pro. I'll leave a link in the description of this video for you to go download it if you want to download it and uh, have access to these same types of uh, tools here. Okay. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll talk to you later. Bye bye.